Is it a key component to learning? If you ask these kids, they'll tell you, yes, it is. A husband and wife team decided the classrooms didn't need walls. So they launched a program that takes kids outside. And Paula Evan is here tonight with a closer look. Paula? Well, Dave and Lisa, the program is called Tinker Garden. It's now available in more than a dozen locations here in Massachusetts and New Hampshire. And the goal is very simple, expand a child's world. Come to Tinker Garden. These kids aren't just playing outside, they're learning. First of all, it's problem solving, it's creative, they're using their imagination. These preschoolers are learning how birds build their nests. What does an owl say? Satari Gandahari brings her two and a half year old daughter, Avanush, to Tinker Garden. Her older sister also went. Everyone is always happier and just the mood is better and there's so much to explore and there's not so many distractions outside. Tinker Garden is Megan and Brian Fitzgerald's brainchild. She used to be a school teacher. He worked in technology. Our goal is to bring high quality early childhood education and make that accessible in every community. Tinker Garden instructors are vetted and trained online and provided with a curriculum and materials. Corey Watts is a veterinarian who moonlights as a Tinker Garden teacher. So I'm a leader, the parents are guides, the children are explorers. Uh, so they're one hour classes, cost between $15 and $40, and Tinker Garden started in Brooklyn. It's now available in 14 states, as we said, including Massachusetts and New Hampshire. David and Lisa? All right, good story, Paula. Thank you.